Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to show you how to take a payment on the Clover Virtual Terminal. So from your dashboard, you're gonna click this green button here that says Virtual Terminal. And once it loads, you will go ahead and see the Virtual Terminal options right here. So right here, you're gonna see Transaction Type. In this case, we're gonna make it, make the uh, take payment rather. You're going to put the total amount that your payment is, is for. So let's say it's $100. Right here, you'll see that it'll automatically calculate the sales tax. Whatever your default sales tax is, that's where you'll see it here. So you'll see that it's 8.65 in this particular restaurant. So it's uh, going to be $8.65. You can also take off the tax or you can also change the sales tax depending on how much tax you want to charge or no tax at all. Then you can go ahead and put in a note for the item or service. We'll just put test. You can select if this is a mail or phone sales. And you can even add a tip. So they did a wonderful job. I'm going to add a $10 tip. So you'll see that the subtotal plus tax plus tip is $118.65. Here I can go ahead and add a new customer. If I select that there, you can put in all of their information right here. And then you can also put in their credit card information. You can see here that it asks you if they want, if you want to send them an email receipt or no receipt. So that's where you would put in their email. And then right here, once you're done with everything, it's going to say complete payment in green. You would select that payment and voila, that is how you make or submit a payment using the Clover Virtual Terminal. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video if you liked it, which I hope you did. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this and leave us a comment down below letting us know what you want to see next. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day.